playing with a little mountain music because you got some good open chords in here and I can show you some beginner all the way up to a kind of advanced drum pattern because it is kind of a fast song. So I'm gonna play it through so you have an idea of what you're going for and then I'll break it down for you. Some mountain music like grandma and grandpa used to play. Then I'll float on down the river to a cage and hide away. Drift away like Tom Sawyer. Ride a raft like old Huck Finn. Take a nap like Rip Van Winkle. Day's dream. Play me some mountain music Like Grandma and Grandpa used to play Then I'll float on down the river To a cage and hide away So as you can see, it's a pretty fast song and I encourage you to learn it slow first and work your speed up later. The intro is two chords. Uh, you'll need to know um, some open chords for this one. The intro is an, uh, alternates between an A and a D. Strum pattern for this intro is a down, 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 down. Down, 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 down. Then you go into the no chord part where he's just kind of drumming. Oh, play me some mountain music. Good way to kind of train yourself to be your own metronome with this song. So after that part, onto the cage and hideaway. And hideaway. As a kid, I always thought this said cage, as in C-A-G-E, to a cage and hideaway, which always confused me. So now I know it's Cajun, as in the area. So a Cajun lands on an E. And then hideaway is A. And the first strum pattern I'm actually going to show you for this song is just downstrokes. Four, just one, two, three, four. To a cage and hideaway. Then it goes into the verse with this very beginner strum pattern. Um, starting on that A. Drift away like D. Sawyer. Ride an A. Old defend, take an A by Rip and D. G dream in an E. Oh, A me some mountain D. Like A and Grandpa used to D. Then I'll A on down the D to a B minor. So starting out, one, two, three, four, all down strums. Once you can do that to a pretty good tempo in the song, you're going to take on the next strum pattern, which is what I was kind of playing in the beginning. It's more of a... Very bluegrass, this version. And also very fast. So if you break this one down, it's a bass down, up, down, up. And you play it twice on each chord. So that's why it's pretty quick. Bass down, up, down, up. Bass meaning the root or bass of the chord you're playing. So for the A, so you know here in the fifth, fourth string area. For the D, you can move it up a little bit to the fourth and third string. So you have the drift away like old Tom Sawyer. Bass down, up, down, up, bass down, up, down, up. It's so fast, it's almost too fast for me to say it, <laughs> so. So that's kind of the intermediate pattern I would tell you to play. Um, of course, after the intro and the little drawing part, you would use that intermediate pattern for the rest of the song. Click the link below to get more lessons like this sent right to your inbox. 
If you like the video, make sure you subscribe or click that notification bell to find out when I post more videos. And if you found it helpful, click that like button. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it.